we are asked to solve the system of linear equations graphically. We will graph each equation and we will see their relation. We start with the first equation. We will use slope-intercept method to graph this line. Therefore, we rewrite this equation in slope-intercept form. We subtract 2x from both sides and we divide both sides by 3 so that we isolate y. Now the equation is in the slope-intercept form, so the slope is negative 2 over 3 and the y-intercept is 3. We mark the y-intercept 3 on the y-axis, so 3 is here, and the slope means rise over run, so the rise is negative 2 and run is positive 3. Starting from this point, as we go 2 units down, we will go 3 units to the right. So we just come to this point. And again, we will just go 2 units down and 3 units to the right. So we will come, we will mark another point. And when we connect these points, we will obta obtain the graph of the first equation. We do the same for the second line. So we rewrite this equation in slope-intercept form by isolating y. To do that, we subtract x from both sides, divide all, both sides by negative 1. So we end up with this equation y equals x minus 2. The coefficient in front of x is 1, therefore our slope is 1. Write it in fraction form, so 1 over 1. That means we will go 1 unit up, 1 unit to the right, because this will represent rise over run. y-intercept is negative 2. We start with this point, negative 2, and we go 1 unit up, 1 unit to the right. We mark another point. We go 1 unit up, 1 unit to the right, and we mark another point. So if we connect these points, we obtain the graph of the second line. We look at the two lines, so we see that they intersect at one point, and this point is on both lines. Therefore, it satisfies both of these equations. Therefore, it is a solution to the system of equations. Its x-coordinate is 3 and its y-coordinate is 1. Therefore, the solution to the system of equations is 3, 1.